recording over here. Episode 151. It's funny. All right, let's get it, boys. Test, test. All right, guys. Welcome to episode 151 of Dope Talk TV. It's your truly low-key guy, John, here with me. And today, we have a very special guest. Mike is in the house, guys. Yo, yo, Welcome, yo. Mike. You yo. know what I'm saying? And uh, yeah, we're back with another one, guys. We got a special guest, and we're going to fucking have some fun today, guys. So welcome. Beautiful Tuesday. How we feeling, guys? How we feeling? It's fucking... I'm feeling really, really good right now. It's beautiful outside. Holidays just passed. I had a really good time. I don't know about you guys. Yeah, man. I spent there with family. What'd you do? What'd you Dude, do? Mike? I'm still trying to get over my hear my own voice on this <laughs> these headphones. <laughs> no, but uh, I'm just coming back from the gym right now. I took a shot. I feel fresh. Feel great. Thanks it's for having like, me, guys. Yeah, for sure, yeah. man. You're more than welcome, bro. Anytime you want to come through, round of applause to Mike, bro. He helped us set up these new camera angles. Yeah. He's fucking, you know what I'm sure. saying? This guy's killing it on his own. You know, has his own YouTube channel, does vlogs and all that. We'll put his link in the description and shit. But I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah for sure. Bro. For sure, man. We appreciate you coming through. But uh, all right, guys, we all were kids at one point, right? We all fucking, you know, got excited for the holidays thinking <laughs> Santa Claus was coming around. <laughs> <laughs> all right. How was it for you guys as kids when you were trying to find the gifts that you were looking like you wanted? Like, did you ever just like oh, run yeah. around the house trying to like find the shit? I mean, like, I w so growing up. I was like disciplined, but when I asked for a gift, I always got the gift I wanted. Mm, so, so you didn't have to like, yeah, like yeah. I got the one I wanted. Like sometimes I didn't like, it was maybe like two Christmas. I didn't, but when I asked for a hoverboard, like I secretly got a hoverboard, you know, it was like, <laughs> oh, Santa got it for me. But I mean, Santa was never really believed for me in my whole life. So right. Right. Yeah, yeah, I, mean, I guess from a kid, I never really believed in Santa. Maybe, wow. maybe one you're a smart kid. Yeah, man. bro. Yeah. yeah. He knew, he knew that these reindeers weren't real. Fucking flying reindeer. Like, come the on. guy on my roof. The first yeah, thing I thought was like, as a kid, like, how did he get to every single house? Yeah, I'm like, no, I'm he's like, lying. No. He's like, Jesus, he's like everywhere. <laughs> yeah, time. like at first I was like, man, but if Jesus is real, then Santa's definitely he real. He has to be. Yeah, yeah. I don't, well, that's deep, though. I don't want to nah, get into nah. that. <laughs> he's like, we'll be here for hours talking about yeah, that. Bro. For real. Nah, bro, I remember being a kid, man, and believing. I was probably like, I was probably like seven, seven to eight when I stopped believing. I was like, oh, this, I called bullshit. You know what I'm saying? But. Yeah, man, I remember running around trying to find gifts. Like, oh, am I getting this? Like, am I getting that? Like, once yeah. I got older, I was like 12, 13. I was like, nah, yeah, she hit it somewhere. You really tell <laughs> yeah, I know where it's at. And you're, I, you're shaking the box and stuff. Yeah, <laughs> oh, man. Facts, yeah my, mom, my mom's closet was always the hideout spot. It's yeah. like behind the clothes. Like, she yeah, thought I was like, like, I couldn't do that. Like, just push it yeah. and then look behind, and I would find it. I always find it. And then I, I'll act I've, surprised when I. <laughs> and I'm not even playing, bro. I keep my Christmas gifts, bro. I keep them. Like, ask this guy, like, bro, like, I have. I still have my TV from like 12 years ago. Bro, this kid has the first like LG ever made, bro. Yo, what? <laughs> yeah, it's a 32 lie, bro. inch, bro. Like it just came like when HDMI when came the flat out. Like screens were that, still fat. Like right. they weren't flat. That's screens. how I felt like. <laughs> <laughs> Like, bro, like, it's still working. It's still good. Like, yeah, yeah. and yeah, so I just, I keep my presence. Yeah, man, no, you know? for sure, bro. There's certain things yeah. that it's not even about the value. It's just sentimental shit. You yeah, know exactly. Like, bro, like, this person gave it to me. They might not be here no more. And even, even if they are, like, I appreciate it. You know what I mean? Yeah. But yeah, guys, y'all go down in the comments. Let us know. You know what I'm saying? If y'all ran around as kids trying to find shit. I definitely <laughs> did. I definitely did, bro. Like, I needed to see where that GameCube was at. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? GameCube. Dang. Yeah. Taking a bet. Taking a bet. Yeah, oh, bro. I, I love the GameCube. Me I, never, too. I never had one, though. Bro, that's what the, to me, that's one of the best consoles. Yeah. I, mean. yeah. I, I, used to play I had the PS2. The PS2 was pretty good. PS2. PS2. PlayStation's always been good, in my opinion. I, I've had them all, bro. I've had yeah. the 360, the PS3, fucking yep. PS2. like The regular Xbox. The regular Xbox. Yeah. yeah, you know, like they're all good. I mean, nowadays, I th I feel like it's just preference, bro. Like, what yeah. do you really like? Like, yeah. what's what's your preference? But they're all good consoles. But you guys still play video games, right? Of course. Oh, yeah. Of course. yeah. I haven't played in five years. Really? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah. You're what fucking yeah. grinding, man. Yeah. <laughs> what, what made you stop, man? Oh, you, yeah. you know, just the grind Honestly. in school. So I heard like video games, like they're really good for a certain kind, like a certain part of your brain. Mm -hmm. Um, but. Like, I just haven't played. I don't know what it was. Like, the last console I really played myself was a 360, Xbox 360. Right. Um, my, my brother has a PS4. He's, like, hard on Fortnite, you know, all those games, like Roblox, all those, you know, right. Minecraft, yeah, yeah. all those. But um, I used to be I used to be pretty good at those things. But uh, now I just, uh, just been a minute. I don't know what made me stop. I guess I just didn't. Halo 4, Halo, Halo something. Halo 4, I think, was really good. Halo yeah, 4 Halo was, was really good. That's Gears of War. Of games. Yeah. You yeah, know? Gears of War is really you good. Know, yeah. That was um, a good game. Yeah, I remember when I bought the Gears of War Xbox One S. That yeah. shit was fucking 
fire. Yeah, yeah the it was white like one. Red, no, it was red. What happened to the? He had a white one too. I've had a lot of them. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I go through them like fucking underwears. <laughs> yeah, bro. Like man, I used to game a lot too, bro. Yeah, but it's just it's nothing wrong with it, bro. You grow up, you start doing different shit. You start getting you know yeah. different goals in your head, and you're like, dog, I might not want to spend seven hours a day on Xbox. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, and it's cool, bro. I like, used to do that all nighters and shit. Yeah, yeah, like, me it was, too. I no, no, I think daylight. I know what happened. I think I had the 360. I didn't have enough money for the PS4 mm-hmm. or the PS3. Actually, is what came out after the Xbox 360, or was it that PS4? I'm not, I think it was the PS4. Okay, so I didn't have enough money for that, and everybody was transitioning over to the PS4. So yeah. when I said let's hop on like the Xbox 360, everyone's like, the what? what? The fuck <laughs> you know, like, what? And everyone dinosaur over yeah. here. Yeah. And the Xbox One, the Xbox One, that was what I was gonna say yeah. too. Yeah. And I just didn't have enough money for it at the time. That's what, I think that's what made me stop. Is like I got kind of bullied into like just <laughs> stop. Nah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, you don't got it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you don't have the Xbox One? Like, what, fucking you loser. Fucking yeah. Broken over here. Yeah. Come on, bro. <laughs> For nah, real, for real, it happens, man. That's, that's how it goes, bro. Yeah. Like, you gotta stay with her. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but that's around the time I found my hobby is in video. Yeah. yeah. And that's when I started oh, making man. short films with my 3DS. I was big on 3DS, actually. Really? Yeah, yeah. That's how you started? Pro- yeah, actually, Fuck, it is. That's amazing, bro. Yeah, yeah stop motion. Like, on people Lego. talk shit. Like, they don't have yeah. a camera, a 3DS, dog. He's going to school <laughs> Y'all for film, take too. Some fucking yeah. notes, bro. This guy knows what he's doing, man. It's not film that you're going for? No, I was just telling him I'm not going for film. Like, oh, you, you're not? Think, yeah, I'm doing um, advertising. Advertising? Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's smart, bro. You can work for anybody. But he still knows his shit about film so yeah <laughs> well advertising they teach you like they kind of got some classes about film but yeah. just like not it's like advertising marketing at uf you know kinda yeah like. so, that's awesome yeah. that's cool man round of applause to this guy man <laughs> going to school you know what i'm saying doing this shit he's on his grind going to the gym twice a day twice a day what like, the you're, fuck like what are you you're, 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 you're like, president of something too right well so press so i'm the vice president i actually recently um Let's hold that out for another. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Nah, yeah. Let's let's just yeah. know he's important. Hey, yeah, round of applause just for know. them for giving me a bang, though. I appreciate this. You oh, know, hey. My, like fourth energy drink of the day. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you need it, bro. When you got to go to the gym again, bro. That shit, bro. You definitely need it. I yeah. remember my first set of equipment was an HD PVR. What's that? It's one of those like just wow. like a, I don't before yeah. <laughs> before screen recordings like you know how you could just screen record on your Xbox and shit mm. like for that to happen you needed like another de- like another device and it's called HD PVR it was probably like one of the best screen recorders out there and I had a laptop connected to it it was awesome so I'd press record on the laptop and then it would record what's on the screen yeah mm. and uh, that was when Phase just like started dropping yeah this guy like, yeah. this right. guy. W- yeah, Phase. Uh, yeah, right? yeah. I'm friends with Eric. He's one of the he's one of the founders yeah. of Phase. Yeah, yeah. The, the yeah. gaming, right? Yeah, yeah the gaming. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I never really watched them, but I knew what they were about. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah they're bro. like they're huge now. They're fucking working with like little dirt. Like they're working with a bunch. Yeah, of people, they bro. made it. Yeah, yeah, they made it. Yeah, they made it. Congrats to them. That's yeah, good for him and Tommy. Them, bro. You know? <laughs> this guy right here was sick, bro. Because no, like, I know them personally. They're good guys. Like they're yeah. just normal guys like you and me. You yeah, know what I mean? And you know, I went to school with with Eric. He's a good guy. We used to skip class. Fucking. Do a lot of Just crazy show, shit. Yeah. Eric's you know? part of Phase and stuff. Eric is the founder of Phase. Oh, dope. Yeah. so I don't know. I don't know much about Phase, but yeah, I still Phase yeah. Rug. That's the only one I knew. Phase Rug, and then I was like a part of like a whole Phase thing. Yeah, right. so right. that's all I know. But now it's like all like it's bigger now. You know, it's, it's like a big company. It, bro, so it's like, a multi million dollar company. Like, yeah, multi. You know, you got little Yachty in there now. Like you got a lot of people involved. I, I think I saw like a like a dodgeball game that was like sponsored mm-hmm. by Phase. Bro, like there's a lot of big things going on with gaming. Like, yeah, there's a big. few guys that got like a few hundred millions. <laughs> like Nick Merckx had like a two hundred million dollar contract. Yeah, you know what I mean. So yeah. it's like, hey man, if you have a dream, guys, like I was telling you it's before possible. I started recording, bro, don't stop, just keep going, bro. You'll get there. You'll get there, bro. Yeah. It's not. It's just a matter of when. Yeah. Like as long as you keep it in your head, and you keep you keep going, yeah. bro. You'll get there. There's bro. not. There's not a lot of people that are hungry like that. You know what I mean? That's Especially true. at your age, man. That's you know, true. At that age, man. I know a like, lot of y'all young motherfuckers that are like <laughs> super lazy, bro. No, for like, real. Like real lazy and they want overnight success. Right. I don't want to hate on, but like my, my perspective is like I used to hate on those people. But my new perspective as of like a few months ago, and I'm young. That's why I keep developing new opinions. And this right. may change as I go, you know, because I'm always keeping an open mind. But, um, you know, like God made us all equal. You know what I mean? Like I'm, I'm Catholic. I was raised Catholic. So Me too. Me too. But, um. 
Oh, oh really? That's yeah. Good. Are you yeah, are you yeah. Catholic too? No, I mean, like I'm not really. You're like kind of like in the middle. Yeah, yeah. I'm just yeah, in the middle. Yeah, I was raised Catholic. Yeah. Like I don't, I don't. I mean, I was baptized in church anymore, but you know? I was yeah. baptized. I was raised yeah. Catholic. Yeah. Yeah. Where are you from? I'm from Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico, Puerto Rico. Uh, Costa Rica, and then yeah, you? yeah. I was born in Puerto Rico, but you know, I, my dad's from Norway. I was baptized in Norway. You cool. know, so cool. I, you that's know. dope. That's yeah. dope. I didn't know you were baptized. Yeah, Kevin too. Kevin was baptized in Norway too. Yeah, yeah. But I was just saying, like, we're all created equal. Like, right. I don't, I don't want to hate on people that are just, like, quote-unquote lazy. Because you never know. Like, those could just be the people that are working underground. And they're coming up. That's true. You know what I mean? Like that is you, true. It's like you spy on them. They're, like, dude, hacking or something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like the, no, that's true. These scammers, bro. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> they're yeah. running around, man. They're fucking. That's some scary ass shit PPP nowadays. PPP loans and shit. Right? My, bro, I don't. <laughs> I'm going to tell you what, man. Like, a lot of people got away with that shit. And a lot of people are getting caught with that shit too. I, I just I don't recommend it. Man, That's scary. Don't be a dummy. Yeah, they're gonna find you. You're <laughs> gonna go buy. Dummy, you're, you're gonna buy your first house, and they're gonna be like, "Hey, man, like you owe like fifty grand." A loan scam? Yeah. What's that about? I've like heard the, of that. You you remember the PPP loans and shit? No. Nah. It was like I'm business too young loan. to know about all well, that. Oh yeah, I <laughs> mean, yeah, yeah. I guess he, he has a it, little. Yeah. yeah, but it's it's just it was these loans the government was giving out during yeah. the pandemic. Okay. For businesses. Oh, I did hear about that. Yeah. yeah. And that's like people were using them for oh, like oh I did not hear about businesses. That. I heard about that. I didn't know it was called the PPP loan though. That's kind of yeah. funny. PPP. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was like what? Yeah, that's, what that's what it was yeah. called. But like, there's people that like, bro, they got given like a few million dollars oh, for yeah. a business. That oh, was yeah, that's never legit. That. Yeah, yeah. You know, my, like, my friend's family, I think they got that too. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. mean, if you're a legit business, a lot of businesses like yeah. benefited from it because all you like, they'll give you whatever amount of money. And as mm -hmm. long as you can prove you use 60% of it on mm -hmm. your business, mm -hmm. payroll, equipment, whatever you need, yeah. like you don't have to pay it back. Why not though? That's like some BS, yo. Cause like you're 60. I mean, I guess. They probably have a reason for it. I don't know because tax I write off business. something. So I don't know what it is, but that that's a, that's a decent stipulation. Like you got to think about it. If somebody get, if if they gave you a hundred grand yeah. for your business, hundred grand, yo. If they get, they were giving people some millions. Yeah. They so were. like, if they give yeah. you a hundred grand for a business loan, you could you go spend sixty on it, computers, whatever you need for your business, yeah. infrastructure, hiring somebody, yeah. and then the other forty thousand you could just pocket. I mean, I guess because like they lost a lot through the pandemic, but like, yeah, that's what it was. What is it for like brick and mortars or is it online business too? What is it? It's bro, it any type of business, any I believe. Any type of business, dog. Like, like if you, you had an LLC. The stipulations and, like, you could have gotten it, bro. Trust yeah. me. Like, it, it, that's why people were trying to do yeah. it because yeah. it was so easy to get. Yeah. Yeah. But you need to have that proof that you spent it on your business. Yeah. yeah and you then a lot receipts. of people. How do they uh, determine how much money goes into your business? Like, does it matter if you're a sole proprietor, LLC, corporation? Like, I'm pretty sure all that comes into play, bro. Yeah. How many employees you yeah, have, yeah. you know, like what type of business, if you're a food business. Like, there's different, of course. Like, how much money are you making it? Yeah. Like, but yeah. there's some people that like they they thought that yo I just got a free two million dollars brother like you think the government isn't gonna come looking and asking for their money or brother. what happened bro, yeah, like, come if, on, if bro. you can't pay it up we're gonna lock you up no no seriously like bro. we need our money <laughs> <laughs> like seriously what like, are we doing here what like you ever owe somebody like fifty bucks now, now times that like no no by a hundred million you're going to jail. <laughs> <laughs> you're going straight to jail there's yeah. nothing you can say yeah bro that's another thing yo like when you guys borrow money do you pay it back like immediately or do you like wait a little bit or do you not pay it back i, I, I try to pay it back i as soon try as to pay it back as try. soon there's yes. a keyword try here yeah, <laughs> yeah, I, hear yeah. Try. I try bro you know what i mean <laughs> nah, no nah. like, yeah, yeah. if i could get it back to you as soon as possible that's yeah. what i'm getting but if i can i can't yeah i was just listening to a podcast like, like yeah. someone was talking about like the whole like paypal venmo thing if 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 someone buys food for me right and i don't have my wallet on me or like mm. they're like the ones at the drive through I'm going right. to pay them before they get the food. Like, I don't care. I'm just going to pay them $15. Like, I don't care. Right. Like, not because, like, I like have that much money because I don't. Right. I'm in college. You know what I mean? We got to pay this stuff. Yeah. Even, but, like, I don't know. It's, like, it's weird to me. Like, if you if you get food from someone or, like, whatever you get, like, bud or whatever, like, if you don't pay it back, like, before or, like, right then, like, it's kind of weird to me. Yeah. No, yeah, I agree. You, you like, got to pay your dues. People's yeah. ethics are we messed up. We were just talking days. about we that. Had, yeah. I'm like, bro, as, as yeah. men, like, we're all men now. You know, you're yeah. younger, but you're a grown man. So, like, you should be responsible for yourself for yourself yeah. for certain things yeah. like if you go out you know it's okay like sometimes like if your buddy doesn't have it you know you got him yeah. and stuff but like yeah they shouldn't go out with the expectations it, it, of yeah and don't yeah. take Being advantage care of. oh but i got you another thing too is like if i'm the one paying i don't expect money back exactly right. that's the thing if i have it I'll, yeah exactly like exactly. i won't ask them like i won't come back to you like a month later yo you got those 12 bucks from like chipotle like yeah, nah, yeah no, no, no no i know but, like, some people that i like, quote unquote though. expect it yeah yeah, yeah some when people are just like bro you remember the dollar 75 it's like what bro a dollar nah bro there's some days i'll like take my dogs out there like yo drinks on me I'm not gonna yeah. come. I'm not gonna spend like two hundred dollars and be like, "Yo, 
hey man, fucking, can I get my two hundred dollars back? No, bro. It was I invited you, but like, don't expect like, like don't make me go to the establishment and have a good time, and then like you, like I don't know, you don't have any money in your pocket. Yeah, yeah. Like, you know, like damn, that's bad. And just listen, man. Like, be honest with yourself. If you don't have, if you don't have the money for it, like, let me know. Don't offer like don't offer to pay for somebody that you don't have the, you know what I'm saying that yeah. you don't have the money for and then like Uh-oh. treat them a certain oh, way about well, it. Yeah, you no, know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, there, there's some weird shit that people yeah. be doing, man. It's just like I think a lot be, of it has to be an all right like, human. It's like <laughs> you know the way saying? the like, person grows up too. I think you know. Yeah, but, and yeah. I'm just not coming out. Like I still live with mom and dad, but like I just think a lot of it has to do with the way you're growing up too. Yeah, I agree. Your yeah, product of your agree. environment type of thing, you know. That's yeah. I completely. agree. You have integrity too. Yeah, that's a morals, big thing. Principles. Oh, y'all rocking with integrity? <laughs> oh, we rocking. <laughs> yeah, dog. It's it's rare to find nowadays, yeah. man. But yeah, you gotta have integrity, bro. Like you gotta be a man of your word and just be a, de- a decent human yeah, being. Bro, yeah. Is really not what a lot of people to. are decent these days, bro. Yeah, bro. it's like it's like it's a trend not to be or something, which is like it's kind of weird. Like makes you like cloutful. Like when you're like. Is that a word? Cloudful? Cloudful. It's, it's a new it word. Is now, guys. It yeah. is now. It's about to be, dude. The way these blogs are coming, it's about to be a word. Cloudful. It's the, the top urban dictionary word. Yeah. Yeah, that's funny. That's funny. Yeah. Yeah, bro. Yeah, nah, man. Listen, ultimately, guys, just be a decent human being. Pay your dues. Be a decent human being. But you know who are some decent human beings, bro? I've met some, like, cool installation people. You know what I'm saying? There was a guy. I'm not going to put no names or no companies, nothing out. Dylan. <laughs> Carl. No. Hey, Marcos. Yeah. Like, yeah. When when, uh, when the guy came to the house, the house I used to live at before to install the cameras and shit, bro, he was like the coolest installation person I'd ever met. And I was thinking about him the other day. My bro, I'd get him a Christmas present just because he was that <laughs> fucking cool, bro. Bro, like, yeah. Really? Yeah, bro. Like, like, we ended up smoking with him and shit. Like, yeah. he was cool, bro. He's like, wow. I ain't going to tell, right? I was like, Bro, yeah. like that's funny how you mentioned that. Yeah, there's people like came into like install Wi Fi the other day. Coolest guy in the world. He was telling me how his like son went to university too, same high right. school I went to. Um, and we just have a conversation. Those people like they're kind of like enjoying their job. Yeah. You know, people do fiber optics or like like the Wi Fi things. Mm-hmm. Like as miserable quote unquote it can be. Like they just they kind of have fun too. You know, nah, you. I feel like you kind of got to enjoy that to yeah. do it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, they get like, paid good too. They get paid decent, but yeah. it's like bro, you're sweating. You got to go in some attic. Like you yeah. got to do some stuff that like stuff. if you don't enjoy it at the end of the day, you're not gonna last. Like, Somebody told me like those jobs like nowadays they're not super fun but before you would like have like like how do i explain it like they would like have communication like with their friends at the job site but then like nowadays it's like they're too like forceful like oh go do this house go do this house like it's like too forced but like before it was like you would be like with your homies yo i'm about to hit up this house you know this house uh, but now it's like too like regulated by the and I, I guess like there's different ways to manage it but that's just like what that one Wi-Fi guy told the Wi-Fi guy I feel bad I don't Wi-Fi know guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the Wi-Fi guy I smoked with a Wi-Fi guy <laughs> <laughs> fucking fix my internet we yeah. fucking smoked the L Wi-Fi Khalifa yeah, yeah for real man but it, it's just it's the way it goes sometimes man like but those type of jobs those type of people bro like they're ble- like they're blessings man like you don't want to have an awkward moment when somebody's in your house, like, installing your shit in your living room. Yeah, you know? just step like, around that box of cheese right there. <laughs> yes. Bro, I heard some internet stories because I used to work for Spectrum. Believe oh, it or not, I worked really? for tech, yeah, technical support tier three. Wow. And yeah, it was that like, sounds fancy. Oh, yo. <laughs> my bad. Like, if I had to, like, go into your modem and fix your shit, like, so basically just say, hey, can you unplug your fucking modem and plug it back in? <laughs> <laughs> Nah, I'm just playing. Nah, but I would like, you know, change the channel, you know, stuff like that. Give you know? people their passwords and shit. Yeah, give people their passwords. <laughs> like, that's why when I called the other day, I forgot my password and I was just like, wow, this is, I must be annoying. Because I remember these calls. Like, uh, man, like, yeah. and then you're trying to talk to them or like something happens or signals bad or like whatever. And yeah. it's it's just annoying. But anyways. Just get an easy job though. You know? Yeah. yeah. But I heard, I heard, oh shit, I almost got like, my ass. Damn. Now we're good. <laughs> almost <laughs> fucked up the camera, guys. Sorry. But anyways, yeah, I was working for that company. So I'd hear stories and like people would be like, man, like some shitty ass houses. Like people would have like dog shit right there in the oh, corner. Yeah, like fucking yeah, yeah. like just nasty ass stuff. rats popping up. Like, oh, no, I'm not doing that. House. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, if, I, if a rat falls on me, bro, I'm up. And like, <laughs> no, bro, I'm sure my boss would understand. Like, yeah, bro, I would freak like, out. This is infest- infested, bro. Yeah. Like, I'm not doing that shit. Yeah, no, no, never, never. But yeah, guys. Let's talk about the metaverse for a second. I've been hearing so much stuff about the metaverse and property on the metaverse and this and that, right? But it's kind of scary, right? Because I got to thinking, like, 
people are going to get rich off this. You know what I'm saying? But beyond that, like, people are going to get stupid rich off of owning a piece of property and a computer. Yeah. But, like, one of my boys told me how he was, he has, like, a like a headset, the virtual reality headset. Okay, yeah. And he almost, he virtu- he almost got virtually raped. <laughs> like, I actually, I actually tried that the other day. He said he was in a game. Yes. And he walked into a room. In the game. In the game. Okay. Yeah. And there's like one guy in there, like I guess like raving by himself or something in the game. He was what by himself? Like raving by himself. Oh. Like he was like having I thought a you said he was raping by himself. No, 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 no. Like, I mean that's that's He's interesting. We have himself. to interview that guy. Yo, that's a, that's some loner ass shit, raving by yourself. I don't even think rape is rape no, in groups. No, but he was like raving by himself and dancing his shit. And my yeah. boy was like, Oh, like my bad, I think I walked into the wrong yeah. place. And he's like, nah, just stay and dance with me. And he's Bro, like, but it's a game though. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but that's that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. people are really gonna start calling virtual rape. Like, what if that guy? Like, think about it. Like, what if that guy wouldn't what? have? Fun? Think about it, bro. Oh my god. What if that guy wouldn't have let him out the room in the game? But there's no like, there, dude. This is a controversial ass <laughs> topic. But like, hold on. There's no way that they can like. Why don't you just take off the headset? And second, facts. Second, that's facts. Yeah. But they're not really physically touching you. It's all virtual. So there's right. no way of them like actually like really groping you. Right. Yeah. So that's that's. But the not, metaverse I I, isn't real. No, it's not. And right. I actually tried it the other day. It felt real. That's what I mean. Yeah, I felt so like I was really. Yeah, feel I like really the Oculus. My brother has one of those, dude. I put the Oculus on. It was crazy. Dude. No, it, bro, yeah, it's yeah, different. Yeah. We're gonna be living like in the metaverse. Yeah. In like I just hope years. they make them comfortable, because yo, because after a while you start sweat. I start sweating. I, I sweat pretty easy. Yes, yeah, I sweat. Like, I yeah. sweat. My hands yeah. sweat like a fucking river. Yeah. <laughs> I swear, bro. It's just kind of uncomfortable after a while. It's like that weight. I, I think they're going to make it like lighter or something or like something a lot easier. Did you hear yeah. about the new Ray-Bans with the cameras, yo? Yes, that's creepy. Yeah, right? What? Yeah. yeah. Some spy yeah, Ray-Bans? Yeah. Yeah. You, know, you know what's crazy? That's I've actually wild. seen some shit working at Corona. All right, so this technology has been around for a while because I've actually lit up a cigar for a Google employee when I was working at Corona Cigar Company. There's a lot of Google employees. Yes. Right? And he comes up to me. He has he has the prototype of the glasses, the Google glasses. Oh, you mean like the futuristic yes. ones? Yes. Oh, and I can like, move shit. When, it was it was crazy. He was like, it was the st- most craziest thing. And this was back in 2015, 14. Yeah, when it was a hell new. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. it was crazy. He's like, yeah, these aren't even out yet. So imagine what they have now. The stuff that they're releasing, it ain't shit. Wow, you got sunglasses that could record. Bro, we've yeah. had that since 2008. They have sunglasses that'll clean your face. Yeah. <laughs> just wipe your face for you. Yo. <laughs> nah, nah it's, get, it's getting crazy out here, man. But the, yeah, the thing with technology is like, I feel like they have so much technology that's not released. And that's the thing. That's an interesting conversation because I was just having this conversation with my friend Thomas the other day. or I think it was my friend Thomas. We were having this conversation. Um, there's got to be so much technology that's not released yet. Like, you know, like Area 51, whatever. Right. But I'm sure there's like a whole like, you know, cause there's there's no way there can't be because like the government has to be on top of that. Like the there's like a thing is like we have to be glad that we don't know what the is it the CIA? Yeah, yes. we have to be glad that we don't know what the CIA. What they is found? Doing. I, I forgot shit. where I heard that. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah bro. Yeah. It, it gets wicked, man. It gets wicked. Like you you know, I've heard of certain shit like the government does and like certain technology that they've had for years. Like this touchscreen shit, these phones, like. There's people that were in the military in the 80s and 90s that said they've had this technology. <laughs> touchscreen. Like, it might not, they didn't have them carrying around, yeah. but they've had touchscreen shit. Yeah. yeah. Like, they've seen it. Certain pl- yeah, like, yeah. they've had it since the 80s, but we didn't get them until fucking mid 2000s. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So, like, yeah, think same about way it goes. Like, like, they got like 50 year ahead of technology. That's yeah, just they like, got like, lasers. Bro, they're, <laughs> they're using shit right now that the public won't see until like yeah. 2045 or something. We would have took over by now if we had their technology. Think about I mean, it. They won't be using guns. The enemies will be using lasers. They're not, though. Like, wars yeah. now that's are different. That's my point. You know yeah. I mean? like, yeah. Like, that's crazy. It's different now, bro. Like, it's not like, yo, let's go, like, drop off a thousand people in the air and, like, they land and start shooting shit. Yeah. <laughs> it's just, it's different now, though. Like, yo, especially something. with the military, they've got to have some crazy technology out there. Bro. And, and we got to be real careful because, like, one wrong decision. I'm just glad that the world's, like, I feel like the world's more open-minded now. But, like, if we get to a part where, like, someone's, like, super, like, Either you know on either side of the political spectrum, mm-hmm. it's kind of dangerous because then like one small it's thing, like, boom, you know, it's like, uh, yeah, like let's not talk too much about that, but yeah, 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 no, yeah I, I agree, yeah. man. I agree. Like with the way things are on, on this earth, bro, like a world war would be 
Yeah. Catastrophic. Dude, and especially in the sauna, you guys ever have like the craziest conversation in the sauna? Yeah, so I bet always, you guys talk about always, this all the time. All yeah. the time. Bro, yeah. This is one guy that's always talking about the war with China that we're going to have. Like, he's like, <laughs> yo, get ready. <laughs> yo, China's coming, <laughs> son. Yeah, people be having like tonight. <laughs> people be having competitions, so who can stay the longest, bro? And people be having heart sauna? attacks. Yeah, bro. Like, bro, I'm that's out. me. <laughs> yeah, bro. I'll be like, nah, I'm stronger than you. Nah, bro. Yeah. Listen, as soon as yeah. my nose hairs start burning, Oh, I'm fucking out. You no, gotta no. get. So what I do is like. <laughs> <laughs> so what? I, so what I guy. do? So my fucking shit don't oh, catch yeah, on yeah, fire? Yeah. <laughs> no. Okay, this sounds really stupid. My but phone you gotta, overheats. <laughs> All right. Oh, I don't bring my phone, but like. Oh, <laughs> Your shit's gonna blow up. Bro, I'll be having my AirPods in. That should be burning my ears. <laughs> yeah, I felt that before. I felt that before. Yeah, it gets real hot. <laughs> Yeah, bro. Yeah. So, what do you do, man? Yeah. What is? Yeah. It? Well, now it just sounds weird because we're like delaying it, but like <laughs> you gotta you gotta moisturize the inside of your nose. That sounds stupid. That sounds stupid. Right. But, but like you know, like when you go like this, mm-hmm. it kind of like your sweat. It sounds weird. Like your sweat kind of moisturizes the inside of your nose, and that way you can breathe better. Right. But like when you breathe and your nose is dry, it's just like hot, and then you, it uh, could probably catch on fire or something. Not really. <laughs> no, no, that shit feels like it's like disintegrating little by little. Like yeah. I breathe in and it's like. Fuck. I don't have to use my nose my nose trimmer because man, I got some serious. <laughs> I got some serious fucking hairs, bro. You just bro. go up to the fucking coal lump and just fucking take a whip. I put my, <laughs> I put my shit, the trimmer in you my nose, that shit gets stuck. stuck. <laughs> I put my trimmer in my nose and it gets stuck. Like, <clears throat> and I'm just like, ah! Yeah, Damn, bro, yeah I got, got the Viking some... hairs, bro. Holy yeah. shit, that's serious. Yeah. That's kind of where are you from, man? I know you. I know. You, I know you're like European. I <laughs> yeah. know you're from like Denmark, so Sweden area, Costa Rica, maybe right? Netherlands. Well, so I get the nose hairs from my dad. <laughs> <laughs> my dad pops. too, bro. Yeah, bro. <laughs> dad, if you're watching, no, yeah, but, we got some serious hairs. <laughs> He's from uh, Estonia. That's Vikings, so you know. Yeah, they, facts. Yeah. I knew you were one of. Them. Like yes. I knew it. Yeah. yeah, bro. He saw. He saw this, and he was like, "Yo, we are one. <laughs> we are one. <laughs> yes. Forever. Where's my Where's my fucking hammer?" <laughs> Yo, you mind clicking the back of that real quick? With yeah. my camera? Yeah, it's like, well, yeah, we're running, we're kind of running out of time. We have, we're at 26 minutes. Oh, wait, we're good, we're good. That's we got actually, like you know what? That's all right, that's all right. Yeah. Actually, we'll just continue on the next clip. All right, cool. yeah. Um, but yeah, I mean, this, is, this was great. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, guys, listen, we appreciate everybody that's rocking, liking, sharing, subscribing. Don't forget, go down in the description, get yourself some merch. Check out our boy Mike, bro. He has his own YouTube channel and shit, man. Check him out, man. And uh, once Seriously. again, Mike, we appreciate you coming through and, and yeah, bro, you know, for having me, bro. For yeah. sure, for sure. But yeah, guys, we'll catch you on the next one. Peace and love. Tell somebody you love them. We're out. Yep.